Janice will never forget the night her blind date picked her up in a rented town car and his own tuxedo. He owned the tux. I was, that impressed me. Peter was a banker, and although Janice worked for an accounting firm, her true passion was dancing. And I would shuffle my feet at the company dance. Do you like dancing? Not at all. <laughs> but despite their differences... And I got the butterflies in my stomach, and I went, whoa! Janice and Peter started dating before saying, I do. She is a life force and it draws me out. I'm probably the, the steady locomotive that uh, keeps us intact. After 44 years of marriage, Peter may no longer travel by town car, but he's still taking Janice for romantic rides. Peter is a gentleman in every sense of the word. And although being diagnosed with multiple sclerosis meant Peter couldn't open doors for her anymore, Janice says he never stopped making her feel like a lady. He says he's got his treasure on his lap. And when his neurologist suggested that MS stand for missing spouse because of the distance it can cause between a couple, Peter encouraged Janice to join a dance society so he could support her from the sidelines. Try to get along with your dance crowd, which is not a banker's crowd. Until Peter found a way to turn her crowd into his audience. It was just brilliant. Yeah, just amazing. Just about the most loving thing he could do, she says. Every day is a blessing with them. And every day is an opportunity for conversation and cuddling. <laughs> you can either get bitter, retire from the world, or you can force yourself to get out and get in. Despite life's inevitable twists and turns, Janice and Peter have chosen to keep their love moving straight ahead. Adam Swatsky, CTV News.